Let's face it, owning a home today sucks. 12 different accounts to pay your bills, keeping track of documents, filing insurance claims, it's all a big hassle. Lawn care, plumbing leaks, maintenance issues, we could all use a little bit of help. Introducing Home Plan. Manage your home from the comfort of your couch. Pay bills, digitize documents and photos, schedule maintenance, hire contractors, and much more, all in one place, and get back to what matters to you most, your time. Sign up for Home Plan and get a little bit of help when you need it most. It's home management made simple. Visit joinhomeplan.com today. God works. She's always, she might not be there you call, but she's always on time. Welcome back, kind of sewers, to the Cognac Corner. Recording historic, Sula, Missouri. <laughs> Go follow Cognac Corner and AFM and everything that is social and respectable. Ah, oh, this nigga that made it back. Look at God. I didn't believe he'd make it back. I just knew this nigga <laughs> was going to stay at home, but he proved me wrong. Even though I treat Scorpio as bad, but I got some good ones in my life. But we can we can we gonna get to that. So follow Cognac <laughs> Corner on uh, YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, and also uh, AFM. I was for me. This is extraordinary conversation with ordinary people about love, sex, relationships, all fueled, fueled. Look at my cute. Look at my trying to be cute. Fueled by Cognac. <laughs> I keep saying I'm going to short this intro. It don't get no shorter. It just keeps getting longer. I am Mr. Talk To Me Nice. Mr. Doing Too Much. All right, podcast. Sad. I <laughs> am. <laughs> un. Did you un my, did I don't you un, even know how to spell that. Did you un, un my drop? Un. You just, <laughs> Go oh, ahead. My, my apologies. I don't even like. That's a, that's, oh, cool. <laughs> Daddy. <sighs> Okay, um, now I don't even want to do no more. <laughs> she done killed that whole, my whole thing been murdered. I had three months. It's your birthday. Three, I'm so it, sorry. It's not my birthday anymore. No I, I quit. <laughs> I, I forfeit the next five hours because oh she just told me my drop is done. I was really proud of this shit. I'm glad I had the ones I wanted to. <laughs> I should have added the ones I had ready, but I didn't. It was Scorpio that did that. <laughs> it, was, it was my own. It's always your own, man. It's always, oh it's always the ones you trust. Never fail. <laughs> and I have my co-host, the new long-lasting queen in Cognac Corner. <laughs> her soul defines her, and she is so pretty. The lovely queen is here. You're done. <laughs> <laughs> and we have re- returning new connoisseur. <laughs> the new returning connoisseur to Cognac Corner. We have Thicky Lou in the building. Hey, 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 hey. You find Thicky Lou on Instagram at Thicky Lou 314. So that's T H I C K K. But not K K K. There's two K's. <laughs> y L U 314. Mm-hmm. Say that. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Welcome back to um, this establishment of debauchery and foolishness. <laughs> Thanks for having me. <laughs> mm-hmm. oh, as you see, I've, some things have changed, and things have made it you now okay. made different decisions that have got us where we are tonight, and we want to enjoy ourselves. <sighs> even though last time, even though it's your first, second time here, <laughs> <laughs> we like to open up this this with um, some, oh, God damn it! Come on, come on, come on, pop up. God, Oh, so now I'm a bad Greetings. Now I'm a bad producer. Greetings. And welcome. I want to play a game. And the game I want to play is called Straight Shots, No Chasers. So everyone do, you can just, just. Look at the devil. Look at the devil. Now, hey, hey, hey. I gave you the finest of the cools I could afford, okay? Yes. That is that is a rock brandy. You gonna have a look? I, I have I have. A, shit? Oh shit! You know what day it is? Well, I was out the only one that took a, a drink though. <laughs> mm. Good fuck. Mm. Mm. <laughs> I don't drink. I smoke. This is like. I don't smoke. I drink. This is. You can do it. 
It's a bad bitch birthday, but we ain't talking about who that bad bitch is. We're going to move forward. Ah, woo. All right, podcast sad. <laughs> Don't you do it. Don't you dare do it. Don't you do it. Nah, man, I all the other ones. I, I should have, you know, I, I, I blame myself. I should not have enjoyed my day. I should have cut my day short and said, I'm going to get here and put these fucking sounds in this goddamn soundboard for the fools since I hadn't planned, but that's fine. Uh-uh. You can't take a person who came in with house shoes serious. Like, don't wear I don't even me. wear shoes. Like, you see me outside. <laughs> me neither. Like, or clothes. Like, this is really a wait a big minute, deal. Wait a minute. What's wait a minute. Right now, I know so. how the show is. Promoted, but that's not. I'm not. I'm not ready for that conversation. <laughs> quite yet. I'm, I don't wear shoes, but I, <laughs> this is quite, uh, whew, all right. Hey, all right. Here we go. Straight shot, no chaser. Did you drink? Okay, so, 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 what are we gonna do about you and this alcohol? So, what is gonna? I happen? don't know. I don't know. Is it gonna sprout fucking green legs and? Um, <laughs> I don't know. What, so how? Could, how with could, one end, you can fire up. Like I don't. Mm. So, like Diddy could be in this fucking bottle. Like it really doesn't matter how top shelf or bottom shelf or no shelf or air. So know, this is gonna be I our bottle. Apparently, this is my this is our birthday bottle because okay. like I will I will take a, a smackerel. Well, you, you pour with your birthday. You will you pour what you're okay. for. I don't want no smoke. And will, this is cranberry juice. That is apple cranberry. I like, great. Okay, great these are good together. Actually. Okay, great, well then I can, great can, great uh, cranberry. Well, I will do a smackerel. Hold on, let me get some water first. I just I can't commit yet. <laughs> <laughs> hold on, hold on. I'm just a bitch ass nigga. <laughs> oh, Lord. Lord, no, Lord. Not my God. <laughs> mm, mm, mm. Okay, all right. Okay. First question What's your most compatible, least incompatible zodiac sign? I'm sorry. So, so. What is your most compatible and least compatible? So, what's, least your, compatible. what's your best and what's your worth? So what's your best and worth zodiac sign for compatibility? Thus, your experience. Oh, fuck me. Um, <laughs> drink to that. <sighs> oh, that's not that's not how I meant. Ooh, oh, no, I, I feel you like, know, you wait your turn, um, lady. I can't even. T- I don't even know your. I don't know your answer. I should by now, but I don't. I, you know what? I hate to be the one I to do that I to. What the hell? You throw off the table. What was that? I ain't got no insurance yet. <laughs> I hate to be the one to put anything on a... A Scorpio? Or whatever. Uh-huh. Sign or whatever. Even I, I, like, I, I do. Wait your turn. Um, I'm going to say uh, Aries has been my worst. Mm-hmm. And um, they're Satan. Um, <laughs> Satan. Uh, <laughs> toxic as shit. Um... Best, free, I ain't free, had the best. Free on mm. camera, dude. Why you? Uh, do your best. Uh, shh. me, shit, he Capricorn. Did. Then me. Yeah, you, you, you uh, cannot, I gotta, you cannot be with your own sign. Like, it doesn't work. That's not what my vibrator says, but I'm just saying. All right, this um, is McCoy at Corner. Thank you for coming back. I'm just saying, this. like, we is in a close minutes. relationship. Like, I don't understand. Don't like, me. that's fuck. That's some fuckery there. Like, I like I am a trans relationship. What the fuck? Like, don't mm. violate my rights. <laughs> Motherfucker, I identify as a person in a relationship, so <laughs> <laughs> so Can't get mad you know, I'm also trans vaccinated. I identify as a person who's been vaccinated, also. <laughs> yes, and I wish they would give me a fucking job based off of that, but <sighs> you know, whatever. Look at him. I guess you know what? <laughs> I take it all back. <laughs> I don't really, but for the sake of, I don't know. I don't want to piss anyone off for you. No, no, I don't no, care no, about myself. Pissing you. anyone don't off worry, for don't me. Don't worry about me. Just, but, me I'm going to drink what I drink and I'm going to do what I do. Just, but I said what I said. It's not, it's not about me. So you say Aries and the best is what? The worst is Aries. What was the best? Uh, me. Uh, Capricorn. Yes. Okay, I, stand, so but I stand behind it. I'm going to stand beside him. And I'm going to stand beside him. So you think you being with a Capricorn <laughs> is the best thing for you? No. <laughs> okay. I didn't say that. I said that I was the best for me. I was the best. You said the best and the least. I, shit, I've been the best to me. I don't know. And the Aries was the worst to me. 
I don't fucking know. <laughs> <laughs> However, that doesn't mean that I should be in a Capricorn Capricorn relationship. Our horns are too absolutely the fuck not. We'll kill each other. I think we'll kill each other. We'll either kill each other or we'll take over the world. But I can't, you know, I can't be sure which. So <laughs> I think yeah, kill each other. So I the probably. answer to the question I proposed was probably. Aries is the worst. Yeah. Yeah. What is the best human being that is compatible with you that has an also zodiac sign? Is the second part of that question because you talk, what you just said is not what I asked. Now, you. what I, that is, I did answer that because I don't know the signs of anyone who did anything half better than the worst. I, uh, nobody really compares to me. The um, <laughs> Um, but they per zodiacs and shit, I feel your frustration. Um, they say that Taurus or something like that is supposed to be I said, compatible I with asked me. I ask you what so what has been your most successful relationship with a human being that's not named you? God damn it. I said I don't I don't she said I really, Taurus. All right, I I'm can't done. say. All right, your turn, Queen, because she gonna make this is why I it don't, don't work. Know. This is why it doesn't work. That's why too I told you, I can, you don't like the answer. Just you don't like the answer it's doesn't mean it's not a goddamn answer. This is, I don't ladies know. And gentlemen, ladies and gentlemen, I've only why. had a couple of relationships. I haven't had a lot of relationships. I've only had a couple and they all fucking sucked. Two are the same sign. I've never heard. been in a loyal relationship. I've always been cheated on. Like, I don't know what to it say to you outside of me and Jesus. What do you want from me, nigga? <laughs> <laughs> what do you want? <laughs> Yahshua. He was the best Yashua. thing ever happened to me. <laughs> All right. He broke it. He gives me everything I need. Okay. He's always there My, every year. Which, which, what's, the <laughs> what the fuck? what's the question what again? The I said a sign. Shit. I hate it here. Uh, <laughs> I'm about to get, I got a sign. <laughs> what was the question? The best what, and the what worst? What signs are you most compatible and least compatible with? Was the question. The answers I got for 10 minutes, I don't know what the, I don't know what They happened, were still answers. But I think you think you, you lose. asked for it. I think you lose here. Uh, right, round of applause. Don't do that. <laughs> that's thank you. That's it. Thank you. So hit buttons. Uh, I think my let's start with my worst. Let's do that. <laughs> my worst, uh, because they gave me a lot of trauma behind it. I say a tourist. Wow. <laughs> Why? <laughs> He's so safe for that. I just want to make sure it worked. <laughs> so Taurus is the best for you, and what's worst. the worst? Okay. Oops, oopsie, <laughs> oopsie. So the worst for you is Taurus, and Taurus is what? In what time? Like it's summertime? May, April, April, May. Ah, dirty niggas. Go ahead. The best is. Hmm. Free need a drink. <laughs> <laughs> the best I w- I don't even you know what I'm just gonna throw a bur- uh fuck it. Sign out there. My best was the Aries. No, it's not. Oh I'm wow! Not. My, best, my really? best was a Gemini. Do y'all know? I realized tonight after me and this person had spent a lot of time together outside drinking and doing my foes, is that this person's was Gemini. Mm-hmm. My life skill friend that, I, that I've been hanging out and I enjoy her company as we enjoy each other's company. I said, you a Gemini? You are a psychopath. No wonder you here with me, because you don't you don't know no better. You are crazy. <laughs> I was like, you a Gemini? They do got their days. Like, And I don't have nothing bad to say about them, but I've heard bad things. So I just, I'm mm. sorry. I'm just doing what I heard. <laughs> Marine said a thug, Virgo. <laughs> <laughs> I don't have, I don't, I really have no, nothing bad to say about nobody. I just like to pick on Scorpio, because. Cause he love us. Why not? Cause who who does that for somebody who they hate? <laughs> you gotta love us. We the mm. shit. Mm. Well, Ain't that right? What's his name? Most definitely. Here you go. That's free. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> I apologize for my behavior because it is I am am spinning. So, what's your guilty pleasure in and outside the bedroom? I like I love Twizzlers. Like I am, I love me some soft Twizzlers from somebody's grocery, and you get home, 
and you eat your food you pay over, overpaid for, and you, you ready for dessert, you open that bag of big family size Swizzles, and it's soft. You get in that bag, you grab about five of them and bite them off, like, <sighs> I must live and sing until I go to sleep. Oh, shit, y'all here? God, I'm yeah. Sorry. Ah, fuck. <laughs> it's my birthday, y'all. I apologize. It's pleasure in and outside of the bedroom. I say uh, flaming Hot Cheetos. <laughs> <laughs> of course, a be- I bet you do. Flaming Hot spicy, mama. Goddamn Must it Cheetos. be food? I mean, whatever you're... Th- I'm just saying what my thing is outside of the bedroom. I don't even know what goes in that motherfucker. It's been so long. But outside of that door, <laughs> I love me some Twizzlers. You want to make me care? Make me listen. You give me a bag of soft Twizzlers. I'm focused. I like spicy food. <laughs> I am focused. Spicy food is my answer. Yes, Lord. I am a spicy mama. Um, in the bedroom. I don't know if I'm ready for this answer. I don't feel prepared. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, guilty pleasure. If you talk, I'm submissive. If you don't talk to the guy, I like to mic, be man, you, Well, I need you to be on that mic. Pretend that mic is dominating your your vocal cords. <laughs> okay, just not that much though. <laughs> not that much. Just, see, this is so I hate it here. <laughs> not you know, like that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, um, I'm on the mic. Do That's please. what you want no, me to do. No, no, I just support. no, no, no. You want the girl six, and I I've hate, got you. I can throw this table um, over. <laughs> Fuck this show. <laughs> I've got you, baby. Um, oh no, no, let's no, see. no, <sighs> no! <laughs> In the bedroom, uh, like I, said, I like to be dominated, and outside the bedroom, I love to travel. That does it for me. Traveling does it for me. Like, really does it for me. Like an awesome, laid out hotel room, <laughs> like a fire ass suite. With everything I need in it. All green and everything. With a nice balcony so I can blow. Ooh. Perfect weather outside. Kind of where I'm getting ready to go to for Monday. What was the question <laughs> that I asked for that? That was a great answer. What was the question? She said her, she said her guilty pleasure is traveling. Oh, yeah. oh yeah. I, I fuck with that. Yeah. I like that. I like yeah. I like to travel a bit. Yeah. I, I, get real, I get real messy when I travel. Yes, I love traveling. Yeah, I talk gonna, real crazy. We're going we're gonna to end this live because I don't like that. What he just said, <laughs> <laughs> and and that's ruined. Um, okay, let me get back to. I had a song I was playing. I want to play this song while I'm trying to figure this question. Even if it's true, my oh, shit. I was like, play this with y'all. I guess it's um. <laughs> 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 Queen, do you have a you have a question you want to propose? Do you have um, any questions you want to throw out there? I, I have I have mine. How about you? My my the one that I like to go, goes way too long because the answer. Uh, was so good. I do have a question because we are uh what have we, let's say a week away uh-huh. from a new year, y'all. Hey, what's something y'all want to change? What's something that's <laughs> that's you know? What's something that's got to go? Uh, what's something that has uh, to less change? friends, more lovers? Next question. Yeah. Uh, oh, wouldn't ask me. The only I thing about I believe I'll be changing is because uh, I don't do resolutions or whatever the fuck. I, yeah, I, I just it. do what I want to do and kind of stand behind it or not. But uh, I'm not fucking with the fake checker inners. I'm just checking on you. <laughs> you know, the ones who want to see if they still have access. Mm-hmm. Ooh, <laughs> the ones that want to be in your business. Ooh, ooh. Oh the oh the irk. I feel you. How you doing, beautiful? What you doing, beautiful? Ooh, oh, how you doing? Ass. Oh, like no. please yeah. take me out of circulation. I'm asking y'all. I'm begging y'all. Please take me out of circulation. Mm-hmm. I know I'm in circulation with like ten to thirty of them shits. Right, well, please ten to thirty. Yeah, I don't know how many bitches you got. I really don't. I'm not the cuffing season bride. Like I'm. You know you need that. Ugh. The Draco. Stop. I would say. But one thing it's I'm facts. letting go of, kind of what you said, I'm letting go of all the bullshit, yeah, all the I fake shit, all the bullshit, all the all the phony shit, all the snake shit. Gotta go. Okay. Yeah, I ain't on the texting. I ain't but um, what I am moving forward with, 
Y'all just gonna have to see that. <laughs> now she now she gave us a teaser. <laughs> she gave us the <laughs> that was hanging. Yeah, sorry. Next fabulous question I have is what is your most outrageous sexual encounter or place? Outrageous sexual encounter. See, now I'm sad because I don't know what you, clearly we don't have the word outrageous don't mean the same to us. Yeah. <laughs> well, I, I, my okay. outrageous might be your normal, but whatever. Okay. Let's, let us, let's see where you're at and then we know where I'm at and we just go forward. Mine's so, what? Basic. <laughs> That's what I'm afraid of. Miss <laughs> Picky <laughs> Lou. Oh wow. Um shit. Let's choose. Um choose. Uh, See? I don't even got choice. You're done. <laughs> um most of the range. She said which one. I don't even have choices. I don't have one to <laughs> choose from. Oh, I'm just trying to get into a regular bedroom. <laughs> uh, when I was a dominatrix. Oh, wow. Okay. I can see that. That, 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 that sounds lit. I'll just say that to be clean. Mm. Mm-hmm. To be nice. See? You weren't expecting that. Thought I was going to go there, didn't you? I was No. I know. She did it for me because she saw me <laughs> get nervous. <laughs> <laughs> I just play a gangster. I'm not a real gangster in real life. I'm on doctor on TV. I'm not can, in real life. You're gonna die say, in real life. <laughs> I'm not I gonna can, save you. All I can say is that it was at the park in the car. Park in the car. Huh? That everybody been there, done that. You know. I mean, I mean that's not true because everyone can't fit in the car in the park. <laughs> <laughs> Facts. <laughs> <laughs> ah. Wasn't there a second part to that question? Wasn't there a second part to that question? Uh, it was either a counter or a place. You gave me place. What? Oh. You, what'd you give me? Marcus, encounter. You, you gave me encounter. What about a place? But what was the place to park? Well, her place was the park <laughs> in whatever the cavalier she was in, but uh. <laughs> I mean, look at my hating ass, the Cavalier. Let me make those no more. Um, the way you're thinking about it, I am not prepared for all this thought. <laughs> I've, I've wasted my twenties by a lot. <laughs> Point. She thinking. I can't. I'll be so quick. Uh, it was. <laughs> I got me dying. Up. <laughs> we're gonna, we're gonna listen to me right along because <laughs> this show ain't even there yet for that kind of answer. That takes that much time. Yeah. We should try to figure this out. Um <laughs> she still damn. I should have played a song about two minutes ago because she still gave an answer. It's overdue. Tell me your point of view. Tell me your point of view. Tell me. I mean, the car is basic. You know, like that's like mm-hmm. outside in the car is basic. Like a restaurant. Barbershop. Where though? I thought of a barbershop. Yeah. Where in the barbershop? Who's going to have... Where in the okay, barbershop? Okay, I, I don't... At I, the I'm, chair. In the... So, okay, so... Whoa. Can we... Yeah, okay. Okay. That chair been, is not comfortable to fucking, I'm not, just saying. It's a fucking barber chair. <laughs> just saying. Ooh, chap. And in the restaurant? Yeah, in the restaurant. Where was it in the restaurant? Over the counter. Ooh. She, she, she nasty man. <laughs> <laughs> Over the counter. <laughs> you see why she took that one, right? <laughs> I believe you had a headset on. <laughs> um, Hold on, man. One moment. <laughs> I'm sorry. You said large? <laughs> oh, no. <Lord, help> me. <laughs> we all have past lives mm, yeah. or something like that. <laughs> yeah. That's all I got. I mean, I have more, but I smoke a lot. <laughs> I did not expect this. <laughs> Amen to that shit. <laughs> All right. You asked. Be it, I have nothing to follow it up with. You I'm, don't? I'm going to move forward. You're a podcast person. Like, you're, like you don't. 
Like you, you're like you a. Get, you gotta know with some things above you. You gotta know when to walk away. Like I have nothing to go back with it. I can't. I can't do anything. <laughs> nothing to. Say. I love it. You so fucking stupid. I tried, <laughs> and I realized like this is not my. This is not my god. <laughs> I gotta make sure I have enough coins to make uh, right. I, buy a space. <laughs> I can't. This not gonna work. Back here. <laughs> I had a whole Charlie. This this not gonna work. Thank you for willing. Wait, thank you for thinking I could fit back here, but I can't. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I feel like we're, work, we're going to the gym and eating half day with Deez is working out because I can't. This is not it. I done pulled a chart host and most. I didn't even know I had, and this is not gonna work. Like I'm out. My, my, my mind is already gone. Like I'm already out. What's the next question? Mark? I'm deflated. I'm deflated and defeated. <laughs> you go home to your husband. I'm going home to bed and defeated. Wow. You go home to your husband. I'm going home to my bed. I'll talk wow. about it tomorrow. Wow. Anywho, move forward. <laughs> um, if you know one thing about your future, what would it be? I'm sorry, I didn't hear the first part. I'm, I know this is. I, I got more tongue than mouth. Ooh, I'm just kidding. Okay, she's okay. Nah, don't, don't please. I won't. I'm, okay, then. If you could know one thing <laughs> about your future, what would what, what would it be? Uh, one thing. One thing. One thing. Where will my son be? Mm. How happy will he be? Mm-hmm. He's more important than me. Mm-hmm. As, as, as designed. <laughs> you got nothing about that? I bet you don't. Um, oh. <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> don't shoot past me, dirty mu- I'm sorry. It's kidding. You want me to answer the question, right? Yeah, I think I, I, I wish think I, I, I wish I remembered future. your answer, but I don't. Okay. <laughs> One thing I, I know about my future. Mm-hmm. She gave me this answer before. I definitely I gave you this answer this. before, and it's going to be better than that. Uh, <laughs> I'm ready now. I, <laughs> you I've been practicing. One thing I know about my future is going to be... <laughs> it's lit. <laughs> <laughs> what is the answer to the question, it's my gonna guy? It's going to be nice. It's going to be filled with everything. No, I said, what do you want to know? Not what oh. it's going to turn out to be. You know, Leo listens to this piss know? poor. Where he at? Where the fuck you at? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Waiting on you. If they have a two for one for that. I got no, I have no rhymes. I don't. I'm playing. I don't know where he at. <sighs> no, you're not going to be attracted to him. I know I'm not. I feel like he's gonna be he's gonna be regular as fuck. <laughs> Everything, and that's okay. And be the man gonna make you great. To, I'm gonna be fine but, to yeah. accept him. That's like, his thing. He, like he's not gonna be what you think. He, he's not gonna be met the man. Like he's not. He's gonna be <laughs> motherfucking the lawyer that was helping Tyreek, and his dad said, <sighs> "Nigga, I knew you end up here." Damn, I said wow. that. I said, "God damn, ghost." I just I just spoiled the uh, last episode of of uh, Power Book yeah, Two. Yeah, thank you. you. Watch it. <laughs> I ain't even started that shit, but. Thank Man, you. I I know that. I said this is some real nigga. This is some nigga, real nigga tree in here, boy. He said he wrote a letter. <laughs> if my son ends up in, on a homicide case, give it to him. I said like, you a dirty ass nigga to write your son some shit like that. He did kill you. I understand. <laughs> I know he killed you, Stop. but he, I haven't even watched it yet. If you ain't watched it by now, I don't feel bad no more. It's I don't. I, that's oh, whoa, five years. I want everybody to get that. What you doing <laughs> you, right you now? You can borrow my Star Wars log in. You want to catch up? I'm. I am. I'm here now. I want to wait till everybody is done with. Okay, well, I'm not done, but it's my birthday, so I'm gonna keep going with my conversation. Uh, when he wrote that letter, <laughs> what kind of man raised a son that you know gonna need to read that letter? Like that shit crazy. That whole shit crazy. <laughs> Well, someone's lived that life. Somebody has lived exactly that life on power. Anywho, sorry guys. Um, it's true. You tried to save me for myself, and I just pushed through all that. <laughs> what do you know is first about a person? What what before you know the person? Like you in that space? I have I have four T's. <sighs> I'm not gonna tell you. That. You go first. Oh my what? god! I already <laughs> know. What you know. <sighs> Their energy. Hmm. So, so what do you know of her? <laughs> you Marcus, get it together. Right, right. What do you know of her? What do you, what do you notice about a person in like a, a space? So I have four T's. It's like my four T's are tits, thighs, tats, and teeth. Not in that order. I realize mm-hmm. the order has changed recently. It might be because of alcohol, but neither neither here nor there. 
Those are my four T's. Now you can still get fired by having a bad attitude, not being ambitious. Like that's just, you can get fired, but the interview is going well before you open your mouth because it's, it's my four T's. Mm. Mm. <clears throat> the first thing you notice about a person. I mean, I'm looking. Out, I'm looking around. So I, I, you know, I try to like the Terminator. I try to make it make sense. Okay, do, 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 do. to make a decision. I mean, it's not exact science, but like I know the like and I'm looking for. No, mm. I get it. I definitely. Get it. I feel like the first thing I look at is um, I agree with her with her your energy. How are you are you mature? I'm I'm in trouble then. <laughs> Stick in here. I'm sorry. Carry on. <laughs> Don't worry about me. I'm fine. Your energy. I gotta know if you're a good person. Like, like one thing I'm learning is that I'm starting to see <laughs> bullshit for what it is. You know. Mm-hmm. So I can I can see straight through that. So coming with that, I'm gonna just leave. Other than that, yeah. Keep seeing what I see. What you see? Yeah. Well, um. Yeah, cause I'm a reader. Mm-hmm. I'm reading you while you're walking to me. You ain't even said nothing. You ain't gotta say nothing. It be the way they dressed, the way they walk, all types. Of like body language is everything. Everything. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> your face, your demeanor. Just <laughs> you know your stamina, structure. Free, can you sit in my chair while I go to the bathroom, or somebody sit in my chair? Oh, you ain't talking about yourselves. The next question would be, I, I think women are better. Well, I think women are better. Yeah, you see, you heard my answer. Mm-hmm. That was a whole bunch of bullshit. <laughs> yeah, I have like your energy. I was like, ah, she said that too. I'm like, nah, <laughs> so silly. You ain't got the four T's. Don't give a fuck about your energy. Like, you ain't got two <laughs> four. I don't give a fuck. Your energy is great, but you ain't got nothing that I'm into. So I guess we're gonna go ahead and just <laughs> not call you back tomorrow. <laughs> Oh, I'm like a bad friend. Okay. No, if you could have everything going on for you, but your energy fucked up, then oh yeah, you're dead out there. Mm-hmm. You can have them fourteen. If you fucked up a person, I'm good. I'm not yeah. gonna fuck up my piece. Mm-mm. Okay. I refuse. Mm-hmm. Worked hard for this. Yeah. Oof. Would you rather be with a virgin or a porn star? Talk amongst yourself. I'm going to the bathroom. <laughs> be right back. Um, virgin or a porn star. Why is this all cool? Who wants a virgin? I do. The fuck? Well, I want somebody to go. I, with, I, want, I go to my car, go to the mechanic, and they know what they're doing. You want to go uh-huh. to What's a sicko? sicko? I got to know. <laughs> a sicko wants a virgin? Yeah. I'm a sicko. Yeah, what's wrong with that? That's I mean, that's not the I'm a sicko. I mean, give me somebody yeah. pure. Yeah, somebody yeah. that's been untouched. Because yeah. everybody been touched by somebody, and I ain't got yeah. time. For soul ties. Man, you ain't gonna get that. Ain't no wrong with one. The hell? I'll teach you what to do later. That's the thing. Hmm. Yeah. So I I'm gonna have to agree with you on that. I cause uh, now I would agree with you. Mm-hmm. Um uh on the virgin for the sake of purity. It's just, yeah, that yeah, yeah. but uh but because of where I am in my life type shit, like if I'm going to do that type, you know, put it to that, I don't have the patience to teach anyone anything. You have to come equipped with what the fuck you know. I get it, but yeah. even, even though that is the case, not everybody who know what they're doing knows what they're doing. That's true. But so I, like, I'd rather guide you. But as a porn star, you. shit. I and hope you, that you, you all know how bodies. to make love and fuck. All them bodies. I, heard, I, look I hope at that. so. I look at the bodies. I don't give a fuck about them bodies as long I as do, you was clean. Them soul ties ain't no joke. I'm a grave digger. I, I dig bitches up if we need to. Bodies don't worry about. I don't worry about no bodies. I, I do. Fuck that shit. I, I, like I, I get it. I understand. Fuck that shit. Pure. Yeah. yeah. But hold on. It might, it might be, I might be overwhelmed. Hold on. Cause some people, some people up here. It's not like a group. No, but you know, you know, like Some people practice celibacy. Some people practice abstinence. I did an accident. Cause y'all talking too much. That's very good. 
I think he right. It is I'm not getting up, so I hope you fit oh, through. Good luck with that. You went the wrong way. You went the wrong way. I mean, she might squeeze through his mouth. Uh, she got like, me doing shit. God damn. I ain't that damn. That is. I didn't design it this way. I didn't. <laughs> Here we are. Okay. Whew. Okay. Okay. Mm-mm-mm-mm. Drunk sex, high sex, rapid fire, rapid fire. First thing, Re- drunk sex, high sex. High sex. Mm, mm, sorry, I ain't, I'm trying to work on this thing. Uh, white liquor, dark liquor. White liquor or dark liquor. Dark. <laughs> Why am I having a hard time with these words? I'm sorry. <laughs> it's my birthday. Condoms, are, condoms, are, condoms are plan B's. <laughs> condoms. Plan B's is plan A. Uh, favorite <laughs> position. <laughs> Um, CEO. <laughs> this has been Kanye Corner because clearly we are not. <laughs> I, I had to give an IG answer. God damn. Um, <laughs> um, <sighs> I don't Man, really I have a favorite anymore. I did not take. I don't really have a favorite anymore. Nice to you. Oh, look who it is. It's the ghetto nigga birthday. <laughs> Not the ghetto nigga birthday. <laughs> <laughs> look at God. I gotta start locking at the front door. Look, look. Yo, you're back before the starter. Thank you so much, Yolanda. I appreciate you. Hello, everyone. Hello, everyone. Got to be extra. You're number one. I know, right? Yes, some balloons. I start to be an asshole and bring you a princess balloon because sometimes you be at me like a word. Yeah. <laughs> but I love you, though. <laughs> I love you. I love you. <laughs> Boy, I, 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 I love you. <laughs> no matter what the fuck you do, I'm <laughs> Happy birthday, Negro. Thank you so much. I, I I value and appreciate you. Thank you so All right, much. Then. I'm over, All right, then. My my my, my soul is overjoyed. My soul is overjoyed. Hey, girl. Come sit down. Don't know me. I'm Yolanda. What was the next question? Did I miss it? The real Um. Thank you. I don't even know no more. Uh, it was white. It was white liquor, dark liquor. And then comes and plan B's. Then was f- favorite position. Damn, I missed three questions. <laughs> Rapid fire. Did she answer already? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's start with the first one, I guess. Um, uh, what liquor? What liquor? Dark. Comes plan B's. Kind of. Favorite position. I'm going to track back. Maybe. Kind of, kind of, kind of. How are we back to couch? <laughs> <laughs> Favorite position? I'm having it. <laughs> sex, sex. Uh, <laughs> I'm back to fucking from 2022. I've been gone for a couple years. I'm back. <laughs> I don't, mm. Hey, single mothers, I'm on your ass. You need, you need school books and shit. <laughs> Let me stop. <laughs> 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 I'm a baby shower. Uh, wow. <laughs> gender reveal coming up. <laughs> kidding, kidding, kidding. <laughs> You'll never get one of those from my address. All right. Uh, <laughs> um, youngest person you've been with, oldest person you've been with. So my oldest person been 52. So like, what's that? I was, I was like, I was like 20 something. So that's what? How many years is like 28 to 52? What is that? 30 something. 20 something. <clears throat> You need a drink, man. <laughs> you need some. You got. You need a cocktail. You need some narcotics. What you need, man? <laughs> At least he was honest. At least he was honest. Well, I need more. Okay, so that was like fifty-two. And my youngest was like nineteen. I was like twenty-one. That's it. I like. I like when my older than me. I hate young bitch. I mean, to me. Mm. So, <clears throat> sorry, sorry, sorry. I young women. My oldest was trash, y'all. Thirty-two. Was How old was you? 25. Okay, so it's, it's a uh, lot, but it's a little. Seven. Um, 
youngest. I'm the problem, huh? Do it matter? Like, have you like been with these people, or were you just talking to them? If she a notch on my belt, I count her as a, a person in my well, life. Well, neither one, because I ain't had no notch. Oh, okay, well, you ain't knock them off. That shit don't count. We ain't talking about nothing. Yeah. Your turn. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna play a song while you think about it. <laughs> <laughs> you want my use my calculator? <laughs> I need to rap. I, I should have played that song. <laughs> I'm coming inside. I come inside. Uh, the oldest when I was younger. Um, he was. So how many 41. years? I was and what, what was sixteen. You? Wait a minute. Wait. This yeah. is turning to motherfucking Dateline NBC. Yeah. What a... Okay. I don't even know. Uh, I really felt I missed a lot in my childhood in 20s. I feel, I just, you said Dateline. I can't and I can't recall the youngest. Um, He was a baby. That's all I remember. <laughs> Could he buy alcohol? Was he able to afford... It was yeah, he, he can get alcohol. I think just barely. Mm, I like yeah. 20. Something like that. Way? Yeah. When I was younger. Are you coming soon to me? Yeah. No parking in LA. Been over a decade. So I'ma send an Uber to your place. Yeah. It's my secret safe. I don't really like young people. No. I offense. don't either. But uh, I don't take none. I'm an old soul. Yeah, I don't <laughs> I don't really fuck around with the fuck around. I'm probably older than everybody in What are your masculine and feminine qualities? Ooh, I like that. <sighs> I've been working on some shit. I love that question. Good job. (laughs) 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 All right. Feminine. um, Shit. When I guess my sensitivity. When I'm sensitive. Because I earned that. Mm -hmm. I had to work on that. That's not something I always had. I didn't really have a whole lot of a big conscious coming up. So um what was the other question? What was it? Feminine. So masculine. what's your feminine and masculine, and masculine My masculine. What's your masculine? Mm-hmm. Uh, <laughs> it's crazy because I got more nigga qualities coming up. You know what I'm saying? What's the number one? Number one, that's Number hard. One, which one? Which one? You cannot be this without that. Because you masculine. <sighs> Damn, that's hard. I'm sorry, that's hard. We can't leave a chain. I think uh, men great make great leaders, and I'm a great leader. So I'll I'll say that for the masculine end, yeah. just the to keep it. The leadership is your masculine. You know what I mean? Yeah. Just, that's a great answer. Well, I tell a lot of women, like, every man ain't a leader. So you got to make sure the man you following is yeah. built lead, for yeah. the sacrifices yeah. that leadership, that leadership requires. True. Yeah. It's traditionally, My men tend to be so. Masculine. Feminine? I'm going to start with feminine. Girl. She finna be cute. She finna <laughs> be real cute. Don't be mad. Right. Oh, my give a fuck is on a thousand. Woo! My not give a fuck, most definitely. That's masculine. I love leaving. Quick. Woo! Yes, I, 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 yeah. I love I'm extremely that. dismissive. Because I, I, I had to, time, I had to ready? tap into that. One, yeah. two, two, three. Yeah. Really? My masculine. <laughs> my masculine. <clears throat> is money I'm just, making. I'm just being messy. You want some drugs? Money I'm sorry. making and, uh... <laughs> That's a good one. That's Anybody? a good one. That's a good one. I'm sorry. What's your masculine? Uh, money making and uh, assertive, assertive, being assertive. I don't know. Mm-hmm. I think money making is feminine and masculine, though, because I know some. It, it could be, but the man makes the money. The man makes the. Some women make the money. I ain't mean it. I ain't mean it. You know. Sorry. I mean, you asked the pen. But you know, you know, you know, you know. I I'm holding this shit down. Like a naturally, man is- unfortunately, a lot of men feel that value is is connected to the money they make. Because yeah. society says your value is connected to what you can do for her, not <clears throat> necessarily who, what you can be for her. Mm-hmm. So when you attach to what you can do for her and what we can be for her, now we chasing numbers that are fictitious because it's all a human construction. So now we're playing with now now we now we're playing with lies and all we can be adjusted because lies are 
Okay. Or fluid. Let me change but that answer. Then. You're not. You're not wrong. I'm just. I was just trying to get. I was just trying to give my context to what you're saying. I, to I was where, gonna just say um, protection, security. Yeah. 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 Like you eat, now that that that's something that you can do that costs you nothing. To make whenever you around women or anybody, man, woman, or child, you make them feel protected. Not mm-hmm. everybody you around make you feel like you are safe. Mm-hmm. It, definitely mm-hmm. for me, I, I always try to make sure whoever I'm around, we always know we're safe. I'll never put you in a position I wouldn't want to be in. And if, if I say we good, we good. But some people got to just go through it. But, like, I would never put you in a spot I can't shoot my way out of. Long story short. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, my feminine would be uh, <clears throat> vulnerability. Mm-hmm. Vulnerability. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and uh, nourishment. Yeah, vulnerability is, is is a huge risk, man. Like, yes, it is, but it's worth you, it. You, it, it, you got it, it. takes courage. Mm-hmm. It takes courage to let motherfuckers in because you don't, you don't always have the instruments of measurement to know who's there for the right reasons. Because a lot of like, motherfuckers would be good to convince you on some shit you thought you were prepared for. Yeah, you realize that bitch that nigga wasn't it. Let me tell about, even, let me tell about this bitch named Shant- it, I'm sorry. I try not to look at it like that though. It's really what you want more. What more? What 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 do you want more out of it? Do you want this or you want that? Which what's where's the balance in that? You know. I like follow up questions. Like if you don't ask me a follow up question, I feel you don't really care about me because I say a lot of bullshit that requires clarity. Like let like, like let me get a sample. <laughs> What was the question? Masculine, feminine. Uh, my masculine quality. It could be me. My my level of not give a fuckness. Like I'm, I'm ready to leave. Like, I I move in and move out. Like, yeah. and that might be. It could be a lot of things. Like I leave a bag at the door ready to leave. Yeah. So like instead of me trying to find reasons to stay, I'm like, well, <laughs> I guess it's time for me to go. <laughs> You can't, you can't, you can't build like that. Like at some point, you gotta be like, okay, maybe I should not be ready to leave. <laughs> I should maybe figure this out, and we can build on that. But like, I'd be like, I right. mm-hmm. talk to me crazy. I'm ready. My bag is at the door. My Louis bag is packed at the door, and I will move on to the next. I, that my my not give a fuckness is my masculine quality. My feminine quality would be like, I'm. I like. I like. I'm a big us. Like I, I think in us. Unity. And sometimes I might get into a love. I'm a big, I'm a big lover of me, but it's after I feel comfortable talking about us. Cause me ain't do shit for us. If I if I really was about me, it would be no us. But I love us because I know I'm. It's just, there's certain locks in myself I don't have keys for, mm-hmm. and there's certain things I know I can't reach without people around me. So I try trying to bring different opportunities of keys to unlock things in myself and other people. So like. My feminine quality would be a us type behavior. But this uh, the mouth is horrible. Like this mouth gonna make you think a whole bunch of other shit. But when the shit settles, you see what it means. And I'm a big us person. So I think my feminine would be the us quality of like thinking communal. The the masculine would be like, fuck y'all. Bye. <laughs> There's another train coming. Oh my gosh. <laughs> but I make sure you earn it. I said I said rope and trees. Unity. That's I just said rope and trees. You gonna hang your goddamn self? I'm gonna be like, well, well I sold them over them trees. <sighs> okay, I got a couple more quick fire. Everyone's ready. Everyone use the restroom. Yeah, but I'm good. Anything? But another drink. We're at 47 minutes and counting. We're doing well. I'm proud of us. <laughs> I knew us would get through with this and not turn into a fucking goddamn uh, whatever this can turn into. It's how much cognac? Oh, it's a lot of cognac left. Here we go. Mm. So that's a horrible question. Let me delete that. <laughs> okay, uh, I'm I'm regret asking this question. Okay, deep breath. <laughs> Are you a size queen or work with what you got? A what? A size queen or work with what? A size? Yeah. yeah. Like Can you elaborate that? Size matter. This how big. Do the dick oh, have like, to be big, or you want to negotiate? Yeah, I thought you meant. 
Yeah. I, I didn't want to go there. I, I was trying to keep it in my lane. I gotta get, look, I, man, it's some of us that's that. that, that huh, where is my, I need more alcohol and drinks. So she made me do some shit. Ago. I didn't plan on doing it. I'm sorry. I hung that's it up a long time ago. I ain't know what mm. you mean by that. Am I a size queen or. Rick, what you got? Everybody ain't made for the girl rappers, okay? Everybody ain't gonna make for the black and whites either. I'm some a, niggas want to love you. I go with what I got. As long as it ain't, you know. So, so, don't come with, I don't worry what you got, but don't, now you no. just change the whole okay, no, equation. No, 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 I do have a preference, but it's like, mm. I ain't finna do all that, that extra mumble jumbo fucking, nah, I can't do all that, but I, I take what you so got. So, the question, so once again, I'm gonna ask this question. So, you gotta choose a side. Oh my God. You try to be motherfucking uh, Joe Manchin and choose the middle. I need uh, either you left or you right. Left. Gang, gang. So <laughs> you, you a side, You had to bring the wood or we can talk about how you treat me. That's pretty much what that question said. Because <laughs> <laughs> you can talk to motherfucking knife and you ain't got no motherfucking... Uh, uh. <laughs> okay, I look here, Thicky Lou. You're not going to keep motherfucking... <clears throat> <laughs> I'm I'm laughing. Work, I was laughing. I take what this. I got. Like I said, I take what I got. Okay. Uh, no, <laughs> for two hundred, Alex. Um, I'm gonna. I'm a size yeah. queen. You gotta have some. Let's be calling your corner, and I want to thank y'all for listening to the show. I mean, I and this and this was crazy. Now, you, now I'm gonna I'm gonna say this. I'm gonna say. Can, can I? I'm gonna say this. This is your show. I, I'm, I'm, just, gonna I'm just a this. vessel. When I was younger, I like I I believe I liked them larger. Mm-hmm. Um. Uh, the myth, you know, and big dick is good, you know, but the older I've gotten, um, it's not so much big as nice, and I really don't know how to fucking describe That's why I nice. I take with what I got, you know, like I like seven, eight inches. So I think that's average, nice. Average, average. I think I think that that's not average, and you'd be surprised. Smaller is average, actually. Yeah. But um, <laughs> but I I prefer like seven eight. You know, like anything beyond that is like why? Like God damn it! I gotta go to the doctor. This bitch already on my head about big dick. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, the big dick fuck with you. My gynecologist told me to stay away from big dick. Big dick fuck with you and fuck with your bladder. Now you the bitch that's running to the bathroom fast. Like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I'm telling like, big dick is a travesty. That motherfucker gonna knock your goddamn bottom out. You're gonna be like, God damn, is the bottom there? Is it still there? Nigga, are you in still in there? You know, I, you know, I still feel you type dick. You know what I'm saying? That like, shit, God damn. Like, like, that's I mean, a lot of dick, you know? Shit but. Hurt. I'm sorry. I, and then, and then, and then, you know what? You know what? And then with the dick emphasis, um, <laughs> I just can't have a motherfucker motorboat, powerboat fucking kill me, nigga. I am looking closer to 50 than 25. That's for that young lady. And she don't even want it. Okay. <laughs> so, you know, where I am, it's like, okay, I need to know you're there. I need some punishment. However... <laughs> I really just need you to make the, the make it happen with these walls. You know what I'm saying? Just make it happen with the walls. Hit the bottom couple times. But that, but that, but that, but that, we're out. You know, like it doesn't have to be, you know, manslaughter. You know what I'm saying? Like it, it doesn't have to be murder. You know what I'm saying? Now, I'm just saying I could be on the first 24, not the first 48. Like it can, you know, it doesn't have to be. You know, <laughs> and in that, with that being said, then I mean, as long as he can reach the promised land, which is the bottom, because my uterus is still attached, as long as he can touch the uterus, you know, I don't give a damn what that motherfucker in length motherfucking say. As long as that motherfucking tap that goddamn bottom, so taking what you got. That's not really the same thing. That's not really the same thing because taking what you got could be a five incher and he can't, you know, he's having a, you know, he's looking, he's having a, like, you can't go any further in there, my boy. Like, your balls is right there. You know, like, I think they're going to stop you. I don't think it's going to go any further. I don't think, 
is going to do it. I appreciate it. I don't think it's going to do it, you know. Yeah, so that would be what you got. I need more than what you what you got. You might need to borrow some. I can call somebody. You know? <laughs> I mean, two does equal one, you know. You might need some assistance, you know. <laughs> I'm just saying. I'm just saying you had that's really a loaded question. You know, I really feel attacked. And I could pick a noodle, so <laughs> you know, I pick one that, what I, I can't got. just be like, oh, well, you know, you know. <laughs> yeah, just a nice, you know, just a big dick. No, because you, you know, with big dick, you know, you and you big dick bastards. Let me say, you know, let me put this out there with the big dick energy. <laughs> okay. With the BDE. Okay. Because you big dick bastards. Shout out to all the big dicks. I love y'all. I love y'all. Okay, but shout, but but with the big dick energy, okay? Y'all got a lot to motherfucking say and do. And you do a lot, goddammit. Because you know you can. Because you know a motherfucker gonna answer at 3 a motherfucking M. Even though you have been ghosting the bitch, you have been MIA, you gonna call. Uh, yeah, I'm on my way. At 301 with no draws on. Okay? But <laughs> I that's what and that's what that do. Now, deal with what you got energy. I don't even answer the phone. That's you said do what you got energy. <laughs> Is you crazy? I feel like okay. doing what you got. Doing what you got, it gives you more passion. No, you got damn well he didn't call past eight. I need more passion. Call past eight. Like you said, like you said, <laughs> big dicks, they just wanna <laughs> like nah. With well, what you got, they're gonna they gonna take it. They gonna take their time and they are gonna do it slowly. That's how that's not true. That's not it's true. But true. that's okay. You're 25, 26. Because but, a smaller dick, right? He still will try small. to. I'm not saying small. I said we smaller, said, smaller, smaller. But well, work with what you got, what you dick. Got, it's what you got. Yeah, the work with what you got, dick will still try to take your that fucking bottom out without works. being able that to touch that bottom. Still works. Yeah, but that's not the dick. Mouth still works. I don't care. I'm taking what I got. Well, he was. He's asking about penis, and penis has to reach the promised land. And that's true. If he that can't very, reach it. very, very true. But if you cannot deliver here, at least it will be delivered there. But like, other than that, you're not finna hurt me. No. Ain't that, that ain't that. I'm not finna cry. I think that come down to preference. At the, at the, no, that at, that point, preference, at that point, you're just you know? doing it for yourself. Yeah, I need it for to, me. That come down to preference. Some people like me. to be hurt. So I'm not. I'm not, I'm not that bad. <laughs> I'm too little. Like I'm, to I'm small as fuck. I'm not really, <laughs> you know, like when I was younger, like I say, larger, but... You know, I'd, I'd like to keep my uterus. You know, that's why I haven't had a hysterectomy because I, I want her. You know, I need I, I'd like to keep her around. You know, I need all the shit that I was born with and shit. You know, he left. We, 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 we ended on dick and it, it, and he disappeared. Marcus. <laughs> I don't have no dick for this conversation. <laughs> Can we get the next question? <laughs> <laughs> I'm, 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 I'm part of the club. I'm going to be... Huh? <laughs> I'm, I'm you said we couldn't pick the middle, so I had to pick with what I got, and she chose big dicks. <laughs> yeah, I, I get it. Hey, man, my first category. <laughs> <laughs> A good love making yes. will be to beating up any day. Uh, yeah. I, 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 I play, I uh, that's right. me at 42. You yeah, yeah, saying? that's so all. That's I, why you know, I, I'm good. I'm good with a 40 and over. Like I didn't, I didn't mm-hmm. have had a chance in my 20s. It's not my, it's that's not my era. I'm gonna wait till later <laughs> on. I'm be, I was patient. <laughs> I know, I know, I know my guy. I'm gonna say, nah, this ain't your time, son. So you right? I'm gonna wait. <laughs> I'm gonna work on me. <laughs> I'm gonna catch him on the back end. I'm a back. I'm a back end lover. Back in love. Oh, okay. Right. Sorry, right. sorry. I don't know. That be taking the wrong way. I don't know what that's. Wow. Means. I don't, know, I don't know. I definitely took it the wrong way. Wow. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. yeah. I, mean, I didn't know yeah. how to explain what I just yeah. said, so I'm going to leave it alone. Yeah. <laughs> Woo. Yeah. Wow. I'm sorry. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> hey, I, I, I lost. I lost. I, I, all right. We're going to move on because I don't know what just happened. I'm sorry. <laughs> oh, that made a left. I made a left turn. I was driving straight. All right. <laughs> Rabbit. <laughs> All right, favorite porn category. <laughs> oh, you favorite that's porn not, category. That's not, that's it's not really fair. That, yeah, it's not. That's very personal. You're really exposing me here. Cognac Corner. Love, sex, relationships. All uh, fueled by Cognac. Uh, young Ebony gets Ebony. fucked by BBC. Wait a minute. Big that was way too much detail. 
<laughs> what? You ass. ass? You fucking ass. That you said, ass. my favorite porn hub fucking that's title. Not a, that's not a whole category. That is a fucking category. Look it up right search. now. You searched it. That's Marcus, not on the, well, that is, that's asked. the same thing, isn't it? You asked. No. Big black cock. Oh, okay. Yeah. There we go. Yeah. There you go. Yeah. Right there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I ain't shit though, you know. So he really I like this. Not a good question <laughs> to ask. Me. I want him to answer next. Really not a good question. Answer, like, yeah, you answer that one. <laughs> I'm way too ashy for my birthday. I should put some. I no, that was lotion. me, man. I promise you. I, I karate chopping. I put in. All day. I put some cocoa butter lotion, banana butter on my feet. Promise. This shit didn't help nothing. This shit right back where it started. <laughs> uh, what was the question? You What's your favorite porn hub? Listen, so I've, I've recently have crossed both paywalls and 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 so I have I have I have you I have X to uh, no what's this called X videos red and then I have a uh, Pornhub premium so like on the other side of that paywall you get a lot more like high, I like I like production in my porn oh really I like high, really? I like I like shit. I like, I like, I like, I like uh, <laughs> that shit but it's okay we, this is his his preference it's okay it's okay they do it they do it for you oh you like the play huh? you like the play right. you like the script you like it scripted? it's just it's, it's real like it's extra raw well you know how they be they be skipping the scenes and yeah. you know like he wants the, all that he want all that because if you go to the amateur point of the beast rising I mean that old four to eighteen minutes I get is good enough for me. They're not getting my money, absolutely not. No, now it's we're going off into OnlyFansville. Like I'm not OnlyFanning y'all. I'm not doing that. No, no, no. You done, Marcus? No, I'm not done. But I want to make sure y'all get get it all out. Come on, to you. So you like a script? So for me and my porn consumption, I like um, well produced. <laughs> Videos to twenty. Let me say, porn consumption. Porn How does that work as the host, though? It's my it's my how does that work as the host? Can I? Wow. I'm gonna just go ahead and answer mine because we still recording right now. <laughs> okay. Um, my preference. Uh, well, let me just start off with my favorite website. It's XXX Videos. XXX Videos. I got, I, got, yes. I got that too. I got free as fuck. And it's like, oh my god. Okay. Anyway, <clears throat> I feel ashamed saying this, but then again, I don't. Where's my head? Where? Oh, I had it back. Had on back. I like. Um, I'm back. Point of view. <laughs> You like POV? Can I answer my question? You like POV? Can I finish it? I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Oh, I like point of view. Hey, Johnny Licking. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> because the first off, this is this is this, this this is my privacy. I'm inviting y'all in it. It's not private. It's not. That's why I said it fast. I like point of view pussy licking. Hmm. Mm-hmm. That's it. That's all. Mm. That, all the energy for that. So my so my category. What's the question again? My favorite category. So <clears throat> so like when you get on the other side of the paywall, you make like you make like a poll playlist. You like you can follow certain studios, and so I have a. I, I like to have the whole scene. I want the whole thirty minutes of like when they meet. It's some bullshit reason. I need production. I want to feel like you with somebody. I want to feel you going to. Have, I want to see. Yeah, I want you in this nice ass house. You don't know how you gonna pay this fucking pizza. <laughs> yeah. I be skipping past that shit so fucking fast. Skip it. Skip it. Just gotta skip it. Get to the point and let's get it there now. Who was the storyline to a fucking porn? Who was that? The birthday boy. I don't want the fucking. I want the story. Why does she want pizza? Make me a believer. Extra dressing. Oh my god. Thank you, Lou. I'm sorry. 
<laughs> I'm sorry for all my behavior on, oh, on this man. night. Is this what skates Spike. Right. Is Spike Lee doing? Right. I'm sorry. Okay. All right. We're going to get. So the question of the night was Disney effect. That was that was the main question. Yeah, I'll be bullshitting. Yeah, no, nah, we ain't over. We ain't over till I'm done. I got some good questions too. So, so Disney effect. So the question of Disney effect. <laughs> Free, what you say? <laughs> He just tripping off how you paying for this shit because he just now paying for Netflix. So he's trying to like, how the fuck you got this disposable? Money? Like, the fuck? I'm, I'm with him. Like, oh shit, they want. Once again, I have no children. I have no wives or baby mama. So, what I don't save, I'm doing bullshit with. I'm sorry. I wish I was a better person, but <laughs> until then, I'm back to fucking 2022. So hey, single mothers, I'm back outside. I'll see y'all soon. Christmas coming up. New Year's around the corner. You know how to find me. I'm sorry. <laughs> All right, here we go. All right. So Disney effect. Sorry, I left time. So Disney effect is like a lot of women. Like I said, we're talking outside. Like Disney effect for me means like women. Some some women, I would say younger than fuck. Maybe my generation. So I mean, Quinny. So I'm not talking about you. Just wait till I get done. Like what I'm was. saying. It feel like you was. I'm, I'm not shooting. Them. When I I'm shoot sorry. you, you will know. I'm sorry. <sighs> So I was saying it was like you meet women, like I say it's like young women, it's probably under 35. That's in, in, in inoculated. Well, now now let me make my yeah, make most explain. You meet a lot of white women that's into that princess <laughs> shit. And I said, Your daddy ain't a fucking king, and your mama ain't a queen either. Them niggas on glass houses. <clears throat> And like that, that princess shit throws me off. I'm like, I don't want a princess because I'm not finna do that princess shit. So like a lot of women are infatuated with that whole like like not a fiance, all these like crazy ass like reality shows has this Disney effect too, because they're trying to sell you a fictitious version of a relationship. Love. And you meet real women that has uh some kind of tie to that logic, which is not gonna work out for them in the long run because it's impossible to live to that standard. So when I say Disney effect, you will meet women under thirty five that's that's inoculated or attached to that Disney quick served effect. So my question is, um, what is the consequences to that on your thoughts as well? Because I just made all that up, but it sounded good. It was God right there. Me? <laughs> yeah, it's on you. Um, Unless you got something, you, you want to go first. I knew you. I knew you didn't. That's why I asked her. <laughs> <clears throat> I'm kidding. You showing out today? I know. I'm sorry. Oh, shit. Towards the wrong Scorpio. I'm so- oh. Okay. Uh, <laughs> well, I can't really answer for uh, those. Yeah, yeah. No, no. no. Just, just, just your thoughts on that. Like, is it, like that, 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 that version of thinking. <laughs> that's how in it itself. Works. I mean. Um, <clears throat> Okay, so as a little girl, right? Um, yeah, uh, you're told princess versus queen, mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. depending on your household mm-hmm. and how you was raised up. If you have a commit household. The parents are, you know what I'm saying? That's what they believe. Mm-hmm. Then they were most likely raising their daughter and telling her she's a queen mm-hmm. or a goddess, right? Um, and But for the average, you know, then it's like, you know, your daddy's little princess or your mama's princess, you know? It's not, oh, you mama's queen. You know, you daddy's mm-hmm. queen because traditionally in a black household, mama's the queen. Mm-hmm. You know, so that's not even a title you see for yourself until you get out of mama's house. <laughs> Quite frankly, um, you may say that when you get a little older, but that's not. But you're still sitting at the uh, the kiddie table mm-hmm. at the family gatherings. You understand what I'm saying? So <laughs> princess is just the, the feminine archetype that one gives to a little girl coming up. And I believe that that's probably 
the reference that a lot of older women or women in general have, uh, in essence, and still use that title. Not, I don't think it's so much having to do with uh, the perfect relationship. Now that that's going into a different kind of thing, but uh, and then that's <laughs> that's not realistic, you know. Some people don't think realistically, you know. So that's that's where I'm at with it, I guess. People aren't realistic, <clears throat> you know, but I don't come from that kind of place. I come from a real raw house. You come from, you come from where it counts. Quinny, what's up? you want to add to that? You think you want to? Uh, I definitely <laughs> understand what she's saying. Um, I guess since we started when we were younger, that's when it happened with me too. I always just looked at myself as a queen. So I grew up as a queen. So like <clears throat> just carrying myself a certain way. I don't know. I had to go through a couple frogs. You got to kiss some frogs. Yeah, life is life is to be lived. Yeah, you know, and um, I definitely understand what she's saying and what you're saying. It's definitely a fantasy people live by, but like, it is reality to this shit. So, um, the way I look at it now is just just not lose uh hope on love, regardless of how you're looking at it. Uh, and um life don't work without love man yeah, it really you, you don't. got you gotta love you like i can't i can't teach you how to love you that part that, like, that part i Re- can't that, do that the reality for you. Of and, and, it should, and, and it should be my responsibility as well all i can do is teach you how to love me the way i know how to love myself because i've chosen to spend time to figure out how i love myself but even that time <laughs> to figure that out was a luxury everyone's not given everyone's not blessed to have that time of Self discovery because you put in position to be the adult in the house that maybe you shouldn't have to be adult. There's so many different things that comes along with the cause you're dealt, but like getting that getting that hand dealt to where I can figure. Oh, everyone don't get the time to figure out that shit is sh- that some motherfuckers is bad for you and some shit is bad to do. Some people is just thrown into a situation to figure in real time. So like, I don't know how we got here. What was the question again? I the Disney effect. I there we go. Somebody. I'd attention. also like to digress. Um, I'm listening. Thank you so much for your, for your help. You know, again, it goes back to upbringing and everything because I didn't know any uh, girls coming up in my neighborhood who felt like they were a princess mm-hmm. or a mama was telling them they was a princess. Mama taught us that to keep your legs closed. You know what I'm saying? To, you know, be good when you're at school. To, you know what I'm saying? Wear shorts up under your dress. You know what I mean? When you go outside and shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, mama, you know what I mean? Mama gave us those kind of, it wasn't, oh, you're a princess. You know, now, maybe if it was up north. Practical advice. um, um, An affluent home, you know, maybe she's told she's a princess. Mm -hmm. But in the Midwest, all food stamps. And doing what we got to do, keep your motherfucking legs closed, take your ass to school, and bring that ass home, do your homework. Oh, Let me get that hair done. Man, oh, Fry shit. that chicken. Oh. This is how you do that. This is what Laurie's look like. Oh. This is what a bitch ass nigga look like. Oh. You know, it wasn't, oh, you're a princess. Like, bitch, you watched Princess. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? I watched Cinderella. I didn't think I was her. I mean, maybe I did on a Saturday when mama wanted you to clean and she put on <laughs> the Isley Brothers. I'm definitely a fucking <laughs> Cinderella. <then. laughs> That's as close to the motherfucking royalty we got there. <laughs> Personally, my grandmother, my grandmother, my mom's mom name was Queen, and that's what who, that's who I represent. That's who I go by, and I'm only just following her footsteps. So, whatever move that I make is based on what I think my grandmama would do. Because, first of all, her name was literally Queen. And, yeah. Shout out to Queen. R.I.P. Whoever poured that drink in that cup. You did. Works for all 55. <laughs> that 518 Bates. <laughs> Who was no goddamn juice in that bitch? <laughs> it was all the cognac that I poured into it. <sighs> As a man, <laughs> oh, yeah. 
to answer that question and where I'm at in my life Excuse me. and where I've been for a while. That princess shit whack. And <laughs> I don't hear to it. I hate young people. So like I don't even like I don't even <laughs> I don't even like I don't, you. You my age. I'm like ah shit. You ready to hit this blunt? Can you read? You ready to hit this blunt? I'm not. I'm. I'm ready. I'm not. I am not ready, sir. I am still doing my show. No wait for. Don't wait for me. I got plenty of. So I have got plenty a book of, out. You seem like you. Seem like you I, I have plenty of what I need. Book. What's up? Talk, what, talk about the book. What, yeah, what I'm waiting on us to get to Thicky Lou, but yes, I, but, yes, you, no, yes, but go, you can, please. But yes. I, I, I really like the. Whatever questions you, you got, yeah, no, you make it about you. What's so? Th- what's the book? So where can we find the book, said girl? I'm, so, I'm not gonna make it about me. I'm just it is, saying this is I your like show. the plug. I'm here all the time. You are a guest, so you make <laughs> it all about all the you. Time. We here all the time. We still figuring this out, but you here. We, this is about Joe. This is just this is a thick <laughs> loose show. Please tell to us about this book. Yeah, I have a book available on Amazon. It's uh, called "Get Through It, Not Over It." <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. It's uh, my second book. Third one's on the way. But um, I'm a public speaker and motivational speaker. So I don't just do the Dickie Lou shit, the modeling shit or whatever. That's actually going to come to a head. Uh, not, not in a not so far future. <laughs> in other words, Nick, get it in while you can get it because it comes to a close. Yeah. What's grand opening, for? grand closing. The close yeah. is coming sooner. Yeah. So if but, you ain't get it soon, you don't get it at all. Yeah. Like a black Asian. I appreciate oh, oh, that. We made a turn <laughs> again. I'm <laughs> drinking. Oh, um Yeah, no, but um so the premise of the book, uh get through it, not over it, um I, is I won't say basically, but it's, um, I don't like when people say get over things, you know, because that's not a real, that's not a realization. You don't get over anything. Uh, from the worst to the least thing that you've experienced, it's not a getting over. You've gotten through it mm-hmm. and it'll always stay with you because it was your life's experience. Right. You know, unless the most high take it from you, there's no way you can lose that. So. I, and it's insensitive and it's dismissive, you know, of what a person is going through. How I respond to life may be completely different than how you respond to it. What may take me moments may take you a year to get over. So who am I to say, you know, just get over it, you know, and project how I feel I would handle your situation had I been you. You know, because that's where it, where it really comes from. A person projects. They feel like, oh, well, if that was me, this is how I would handle it. And I would be over it by now. Thus, you should be. And that's not a fair, that's not a fair assessment. So, I, you know, so I give some uh, details, some trauma details that I've experienced in my life as examples of things that you can get through. Um, for those who are living on the edge and, you know, are on the edge and need to scale back. So it's really a kind of a go-to if you're going through. You know, that's what it really come down to. It's like a, it's like a, I'll turn my microphone up. I'll Self-help. I mooded myself. Yeah. It's like a, like stoic, like stoic philosophy. Like it gives you things to give perspective but so much is right in front of your face. Because sometimes we can get lost and in fours, because we, we focus on this fucking tree. And yeah. sometimes you need to understand someone has been through the same thing and then give you some level of vernacular or voice to get you through the to the next part. Because yeah. you, you can get you can get you can get in, you can get you can fall in love and tans- <laughs> going I will fight you in all <laughs> Yeah, if you've never starved, you don't you can't tell a yeah. person. <laughs> <laughs> what it feels like to start. Exactly. Like for me, knowing that I haven't been through a lot of a lot of things, I'm trying to be heavy on empathy. Mm-hmm. It's a limit. I love to not give a fuck. Like, I love to not give a fuck. Table, but yeah. I try to be as reasonable as possible. At least able to stand on my not, not give a fuck and be like, that shit ain't that shit stupid. Mm-hmm. But I try to be empathetic. I I ain't been through a lot of shit. Like I'm like, I ain't nah. 
Nah, I ain't down to. I ain't nah. I ain't nah. Nah. I ain't, nah. Mm. So I try to be very listen more than I talk. I talk a lot, mm-hmm. and a lot of shit I say don't even mean much, but it sounds good. Okay. But I listen double that amount. <laughs> hey, wait a minute. Hey, everybody. <laughs> but shit's going on. What's going on in this room? <laughs> wait a minute. <laughs> but somebody, somebody not preaching like a like, like they're supposed to. Um. The book is available on Amazon yes. and on Kindle. Uh, so it's an ebook also. You don't have to just get the paperback. I only have a paperback and ebook available. So um again, get through it, not over it. Um just a snippet about me. Um I was held hostage for three days and raped for those three days. And yeah, and uh, that's a that's a real thing. Somebody's been abducted before out oh, there. Sorry, Somebody's man. been raped before out yeah. there. Somebody's been molested. I was molested as a little girl. You know, my innocence was taken at nine. So uh, yeah, but you but that doesn't define who you are. Right. You see, right. That is just a part of your journey you know and i experienced those things so that i can be a voice for those who are experiencing it now who have in the past and who will in the future so it's imperative that a person like myself speak openly about uh those trauma things um i can speak about those things without a single tear because it's empowerment i got through it it's empowering those that you don't know to do something they don't know they can do yeah I agree. Yeah. People yeah. need that. Empowering those they don't know. That's you exactly do that's hear. exactly yeah. what I feel like I'm trying to do. So. Well, trauma's a big deal. I'm a um I'm a, I'm a after trauma survival specialist. Mm. Cause after the trauma, you it's important that you live. And not a lot of us do. We get stuck in survival. And when you've been surviving for so long, it's extremely hard to even know where to start living. Someone pass a collection plate around. <laughs> I mean, if you didn't want me to talk about this kind of no, stuff. No, 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 no. I mean, I don't have to. No, please carry on. Don't mind me. Please carry on. This is, this is the best thing I heard all day. <laughs> I'm... I've been up since early this morning. Keep continue, please continue. I mean, if you just want me to do the thicky loose, no, thing, no, no, keep, no, just... don't do ignore me. <laughs> I am ignorable. You keep going because this is what's the matter. This is what's important. This is what we're here for. I ain't gonna ruin my cup for the juice. You just keep talking. You keep going. So keep going. Keep you <laughs> keep going. I'm talking to DJ Khaled. Keep going. <laughs> no, you, but that's what it is. We the best. <laughs> you silly. <laughs> Yeah, well, but no, it's important. Like it's like, like 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 I was like not to step on the importance of what you were saying because what you're saying is important because you've been sure. through that through that trauma and you're still here and you're still positive, you're still glowing, you're still healthy. Humanity as a whole is a is a traumatic experience. Like it's just it's, 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 in the civilization. I'm very. I, I like to delve in the theoretical version of shit because I ain't been too much. So like everything I'm trying to say is from a position of Empathy. learning from other people's perspective. A lot of peas in it. <clears throat> Sorry. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Damn it. I lost it. I lost it. I lost no. it. I'm lost it. I lost it. But <laughs> damn it. Damn it, I lost it. It's okay. Oh, I was working so hard to get that thought to cross. It was a decent Fuck. ramble too, bro. That decent that was a ramble. Was decent. I was so trying to get I was so confident that I lost it when I stopped. It God damn her, it. Bring it back to her point. Uh, mm-hmm. she was dropping. But the point out. was like we have to have examples of dream bigger. Like you have to see someone it looks like you surviving the trauma you're going through. So when you do things, you have to be mindful. Like you would, there's blessings, there's people you will help that you will never know, mm-hmm. you never see. There's mm-hmm. consequences you deserve, you never get. Mm-hmm. But you got to keep going and do the best for as long as you can till that oh, it's over with. Because you can't, you, you're not, you're not receive all your blessings and, and and punishment that you deserve. Hopefully, you do the best you can, what you got, and survive to show somebody else that you would never meet, never know they can do it too. 
That's what I was thinking. <sighs> <laughs> I, I hope it, I hope, I hope, it come, you got it I hope that makes sense. I hope, I hope, <laughs> fuck. <laughs> I feel like I'm doing the same thing. I'm trying to do the same thing. I had some traumatic stuff happen to me too. And um, just want everybody to know they could definitely turn their pain into power. Yeah. You know, and, uh, I, uh, there's another statement that I don't, I've never cared for. And uh, it's not, it's not a bad statement or anything like that. But, um, just take it day by day. Oh, that statement there. That's the I've never part. liked that statement. You know I why I like know. that statement? Hell well, no. I won't say it's, it's, it's not, not stupid. stupid. It makes sense. Stupid. It I, makes perfect sense. Well, I understand why people say it. You know, it's it's considerate. You know, I like I like when people can be it, considerate. Like considerate. I mean, everything that's cliche is pretty accurate. Uh, yeah, it is. Does it, does it sound like some? Shit, if you apply it right, if you apply it the wrong way, then no, nah, you ain't gonna get. The well, work people, that you, you know what? People are. Um, some people are sensitive to what you're going through. People who care about what you're going through, and they don't Absolutely. know what else to say, Absolutely. so they'll just say, well, "You know." Basically, they're saying, "Take your time, do what you can." But they're not lying, you know, and and they don't go deep into what that really means. They just say, "Take it day by day," but. For a person who is going through hell with gasoline draws on, the next moment is the one is is where it counts. I have been in such a hellish place that getting to the next moment was hard. You know how many moments are in a in a minute or are in an hour? That's a lot of fucking moments, and you want me to get to the next day? I can barely get to one o'clock. I'm doing everything I can to get to the next second in my mind, in my body. And you want me to make it to tomorrow? Is there a tomorrow? Do I even want to see tomorrow? Don't tell me to make it to tomorrow. Help me make it to my next moment. Give me what I need psychologically to make it to my next moment. Because see, the battlefield is in the mind and a lot of us lose that battle. And I want to win it. So I need you to give me something that's going to help me win it, not get to the next fucking day, you know. So that's why I really don't really care for the the statement. It's okay. It's an okay statement, like you say. It's cliche, you know. It's you know. It's 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 nice to say, you know. But I need I need something deeper when you're going through deeper, when you need something right now, when you need something that's going to help change the course of your day, the course of your life. I need something like that. And a lot of, I think all of us really need that, honestly. I don't think it's enough to cliche a person, especially in the times that we're living in. I think you want meat and potatoes. You don't just want soup. Mm. You know, mm-hmm. soup is fine. It'll get you to the next day. Damn, she but you that meat and potatoes will fill you up. You know, she called you, hold, you soup hoes, soup. <laughs> well, I'm just saying. You camel bitches, <laughs> you stay out the way. Don't do that. Me and Mateo's <laughs> in the building. It's time for the percolator. I'm sorry. It's not. I just, it's not you know what? I'm not, I'm not a huge fan of people per se, but. Capricorn, we hate everybody but us. Yeah, but I am a lover of people because I love, I love me some empath. them too. Yeah, love. You know, I, I feel people yes. and yes. I want to help. Yes. You know, when I was younger, I didn't know what I wanted to do when I was looking for my purpose. What the fuck am I here for? Why, you know, like, why was I put here? Yeah. Yeah, You really get on my nerve. (laughs) And in that, you know, I had to ask myself exactly what, what I wanted to do. Like I, like I hope many people do. A lot of people don't know what their purpose is or, or if they have one, you know? So that's an, that's an important journey. Finding out what that is, what you're doing here so you can get to it, you know? But um, I, and I found to do is helping people. So I had to ask, well, well, how am I gonna help people? You know, I'm just gonna give niggas money. You know, am I mm-hmm. just gonna house people? I've housed folks. I've given money. But that's not what I. That's not the only thing I want to do. And as bad as I want to be a philanthropist, I'm not quite there yet. So helping people psychologically, being you know, fuck you, Bezos. <laughs> helping people get to their next moment. This is general. It's important to me. Mm-hmm. Being a bridge is a blessing. Yeah. You know, everybody can't make it across. Everybody can't be saved. <laughs> everybody can't go. 
A lot of, a lot of good people hold on to niggas they can't hold on to. They, everybody can't go. <laughs> it's season, reason, lifetime. Mm-hmm. And once once you understand who's here for what, life is so much fucking easier. I have a philosophy about that. Tell me more why I find this song. Yeah, I have a tree philosophy. It's my tree philosophy. Tree. Yeah, I'm gonna. I'm actually gonna. I think I'm gonna like. Uh, I don't know what do you call that. Not copyright, but what do you call it? The other thing you do. Steal. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> no. Trademark. Trademark. Borrow. I'm a trademark that. But well, my tree philosophy is mm-hmm. the majority of people are like leaves. Mm-hmm. They're not meant to stay. Yeah, they're gonna fall off. It doesn't take a breeze, doesn't take a storm. It's gonna fall off. That's what they're supposed to do. And those people, you know, so you know, about eighty, ninety percent of people that come into your life, they're leaves. They're not mm-hmm. supposed to be here. So you're supposed to get something from them. They're supposed to get something from, from you. Doesn't matter what that is, but that's what that's how that goes. And it helps in the process of letting people go or wondering why people came so fast and maybe they was cool as shit, but now they're not here. Like, damn, you know, such and such was cool as a motherfucker. Why ain't they here no more? Because you was only supposed to get something from them and they supposed to get something from you. It was a leave. But then you got the branches. Then the motherfuckers that, you know, hey, those are the... the That's about like everybody do song right now. That's everybody do right I'm the topsy-turvy ones because... You thinking that that's the one that's going to hang on. They didn't been there through a couple storms, you know. They still hung on. And then that one good storm come along, that motherfucker break right off. You know what I'm saying? It, it didn't take a huge storm. It just took a little extra rain. That bastard is gone. You know, how you fucked up? Like, damn, I thought this motherfucker, you know, but dude, he stayed with her. I when I went through such and such and that motherfucker. But you then, better call but okay, all right. <laughs> You thought they were solid, but baby. Yeah. Call call those are branches. And then my favorite people, well, what I consider myself to be, and that's the roots. Mm-hmm. You know, a tsunami can come and take the whole fucking tree, and the roots will still be there. Those are my favorite people, but those are the rarest motherfuckers. It's hard. Yeah. It's, it's hard to be. It's hard so, to be that. That it's hard to. It's hard to be that. It's hard to be. I look for roots to the and earth. People. Yeah, it it takes time. I mean, it's a process. Like life is a contact sport. You just gotta be. You gotta be willing to go through the bullshit to get there. But yeah. but you gotta also learn yourself through the bullshit because it makes you better. Yeah, and you everybody, know. everybody ain't us, and us ain't us, ain't everybody. Yeah, you gotta quit expecting yourself out of everybody. Too. All right, Queenie, give us a closing thought. Then you give us a closing thought. I would give say a closing my, thought, my closing thought better. would be if God closes the door. Talking like goddamn Mike Queenie, you know better than this. Sorry, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I apologize. Sorry. I My closing thoughts is: if God closes a door, it's what's best for you, because what's before you will be a brand new door with a brand new set of keys. I see even our scriptures. Yeah. You're done. <laughs> we gotta change that. Oh, that was God. the old me. <laughs> uh, no, that's the old me. I know. I, I, of course, it is. I know. I apologize. Thank you, Luke. You give us a closing thought. Something to leave us with a closing spiritual. <laughs> um, definitely get my book on Amazon uh, or on Kindle. Uh, get through it, not over it. If you know someone who's going through something traumatic or. You yourself are going through something traumatic. Most definitely get the book. It's going to help you get through it. Um, something to close it out. Your start is not your finish. Woo! Yeah, I did. <laughs> your start is not your finish. Woo! That shit is fire. God damn. I, I was I wasn't I thought I thought I had a beat on this. She was yeah, I lost again, guys. <laughs> well, here goes my closes. This we close my tab we closing the tabs out with the shit that's not good as that. Damn, I'm feel, I'm feeling I'm feeling not I'm feeling I'm not confident right now in my thoughts. <laughs> <sighs> oh, can real quick, um, I think you should plug your spoken word that you've got coming up and I'd like to plug mine also. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Please. <laughs> yeah, the comments you back there. up. I did do that. You're an artist oh, and you were sensitive Ooh. about your shit. I understand, Erica. Oh. But... Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. So, next week on Tuesday, the 28th. 28th, right? 
Mm-hmm. Tuesday mm-hmm. the 28th at 7 o'clock, I will be at Legacy doing my first time open mic. I'm very excited. And um, yeah, everybody should come out and support the kid. <laughs> the kid. The kid. It's very important that we all support each other. So Yeah, yeah. Um, I have um, a spoken word piece coming up also called Unsung Heroes, and that'll be January 8th. I'll be replugging that. So if you just stay tuned to my page on Instagram or Facebook, you'll be able to see the details of that. Where, Showtime where, will be at 7 o'clock. Um, on Instagram or Facebook, you can look me up, Sabrina Renee uh, 314 or Thicky Lou 314. Uh, the event will be at Warehouse West, um, 1307 Hamilton Avenue, and tickets are uh, available. They're extremely uh, reasonably priced, five bucks. You can't beat it. Food will be sold, and uh, it's 420 friendly. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> It'll be my first time speaking uh, spoken word in front of people. Phew. Yeah, my first time doing that. Phew. I've done all the kind of speaking, but I've never done spoken right, word right, in front of people. Right. So okay, this is my work. I heard it is. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Well, I am. I am joyous, and I thank you for coming down to. Thanks for having me again to this establishment for the second first time. <laughs> and Queenie, as always, you do a great job. Queenie, Queenie keeps me young. <laughs> what I her and all her bullshit. I'm sorry. Why he, you see how you project it? I know. <laughs> it's, I, I'm really just putting all my shit on you. On oh, me? Right. And I ain't even... Look, I got to work at three in the morning. You playing with me. I know. I'm sorry. I apologize. <laughs> really? I don't work till I get there. Uh, love, we wrote it, happiness. But most times, happiness leads you to the right... Leads you right... Wait, wait, wait. Leads you to the doorstep of love because only happy people can be in love. Bye. <laughs> also, trust is lost in buckets and gaining drops. Be careful! Be careful who you fuck over. It's my birthday, so fuck y'all if I didn't say it like I'm supposed to. Uh, <laughs> growth scares people that don't want to change. Period. Oh, Listen, shit. <laughs> Once again, for those for those that back growth. Scare people that don't that don't want to change. So, uh, if you miss any of those, I'm sorry. Love yourself, love each other, and love is all we got. I pushed all the wrong buttons. <laughs>